Colombia vs. Panama Live Updates, Highlights from Copa America 2024 Colombia vs. Panama Final Score, Copa America 2024 Result as James Rodriguez Stars to Help Cafeteros Reach Semifinals Kickoff, They're Underway at State Farm Stadium in Glendale James Rodriguez looks to captain his side into the Copa America semifinals, where the winner will meet either Brazil or Uruguay. Sixth minute, there's an early flashpoint as Luis Diaz hits the deck under a challenge from Edgardo Farina, who smacked Diaz in the face while shielding the ball. These are often incidents that are difficult for the defenders to prevent. But Farina was reckless there with his body positioning. Farina is lucky not to get a yellow card as his arm was all over Diaz's face, and the Liverpool man is slow to get up. But does not have any blood to deal with. Eighth minute, goal. Colombia. The opener has arrived just minutes into the game as James Rodriguez picks up his fourth assist of the tournament with a dangerous corner delivery. And Jan Cordoba finishes it off with a headed flick right on the doorstep. That's some real physicality from Cordoba who wrestled his way around a defender ironically, Jose Cordoba, and found the connection. And James Rodriguez now has twice as many assists as anyone else at the tournament. 13th minute, penalty, Colombia. Oh, it's a terrible mistake by Panama goalkeeper Orlando Mosquera, who reaches to parry away the ball but gets all of Ihan Arias's legs instead. The incident takes place at an extremely tight angle near the end line. In a position where Mascara did not need to come off his line. It's a clear penalty, and VAR confirms the decision. It took ages for the review to take place, but eventually. It's a penalty indeed. James Rodriguez steps up to take, as the captain of the side, and dot goal. Colombia. You knew he wasn't missing with that chance and he roofs it into the top right corner. Absolutely thumped. 18th minute, chance, Panama. Whoa. What a chance for the underdogs to pull one back. From a free kick about 30 yards out, it's directed on net by Roderick Miller, and the headed effort hits the woodwork. Incredibly. The ball redirects along the goal mouth, and is absolutely on a line for the back of the net, but somehow goalkeeper Camilo Vargas, who was rooted to the spot on the header, scrambles awkwardly to clear the chance. The goalkeeper knew nothing about it, but was in the right place at the right time to make an absurd save. The incident cannot be checked to see if the ball went over the line. As Conmebol is not using goal line technology at the Copa America and there are no cameras along the goal line, seems an odd decision for sure. 23rd Min Panama have had an exceptional response after the two early Colombia goals. They've turned on the Jets and are troubling the Colombia back line on numerous occasions. They've started pressing hard in midfield and are forcing a number of turnovers as a result. 28th Min, Chance, Colombia. Panama's recent push forward has been bright for the most part, but it's also leaving spaces in behind. Colombia nearly take advantage as Ihan Arias finds himself in a two-on-two -two situation and rifles a shot that's seeking the top left corner but is deflected out for a corner. 34th Min, Panama midfielder Giovanni Welch ends up with a surprising amount of space to shoot while on the ball about 35 yards from goal. But his effort is disappointing and one hops into the safe arms of Camilo Vargas. 36th Min, Panama have a free kick from a dangerous position about 25 yards out in a central position after Jose Cordoba is fouled out top of the semicircle. Edgar Barcenas blasts it straight into the wall. 39th Min, James Rodriguez is down on the ground rolling around in agony after a challenge by Giovanni Welch. Colombia want a booking for Welch. But there's such incidental contact that nothing is rightly given. James is fine and comes back onto the pitch after a short time on the touchline for treatment. 41st Min, Goal Colombia Just as Panama were looking to break back into the game. Colombia has gone three in front and killed off the game. Off a quick restart that even catches the camera crew off guard, a free kick is delivered on the run for Luis Diaz. It's dropped straight into a bucket by James Rodriguez. 
and the Liverpool man chips the goalkeeper expertly for the finish. What a gut punch! 45th min. The game's first yellow card is shown to Colombia midfielder Mateus Uribe for a bad tackle on Christian Martinez. Halftime, Colombia 3-0 Panama. Colombia are in complete control and well on their way to a semi-final berth. They got too early as James Rodriguez became the first player in Copa America history to score and assist a goal in the opening 15 minutes of a match since assist tracking began in 2011. And then he assisted a second as Luis Diaz put them three out in front. Panama had one good spell after falling two goals behind, but the Diaz goal put an abrupt stop to that spirited effort. Colombia have made sure this one's not in doubt and it would take a Herculean comeback for Panama to even have a sniff. Rodriguez ends the opening 45 minutes with a goal and two assists. As the 32-year-old has had a brilliant revival this summer. Second half kickoff, they're back underway in Glendale, and Panama have made two changes, as Eduardo Guerrero and Carlos Harvey come on to replace Roderick Miller and Cesar Blackman. The CONCACAF side looked bright after falling behind 2-0, but the risks taken to go all-out attack caused them to concede again. Will they have anything to challenge Colombia from securing a smooth, effortless win? 49th Min, Luis Diaz is licking his chops at the space in behind the Panama fullbacks, who are pushed high as they search for a lifeline. This time, he's brought down by a very good tackle from Jose Fajardo. But it's left the Panama striker in a great deal of pain. This is quite concerning for Panama, as Fajardo has been their best goal-scoring threat at the 2024 Copa America. Thankfully, he's eventually okay to come back on. 54th Min, a yellow card is shown to Giovanni Welch, who body-checks James Rodriguez to the ground. The Italian referee immediately goes to his pocket. But it's a bit unlucky for the Panama player who maybe was himself the subject of a foul from his Colombian counterpart but his hands up to the face of James probably swung things in the other direction. 58th Min, Panama are starting to foul Colombia off the pitch. Eric Davis takes down Luis Diaz while another Colombian player lays on the pitch from a coming together seconds earlier. They were borderline dirty against the United States in their upset win during group play, and you wonder as this game goes on if their frustration begins to get the best of them. 64th Min, now another yellow card is shown to Panama defender Edgardo Farina who sides down Luis Diaz from behind as the Liverpool man charged in on goal. It's a really bad tackle. With a scissor motion from behind, reminiscent of the borderline dirty challenges they had in the final stages of the match against the United States. Sure enough, Colombia boss Nestor Lorenzo knows there's no reason to leave Diaz in to take further punishment. And he hauls the star winger off, replaced by Luis Sinistera. Jorge Carrasco also enters the match to replace Ihan Arias. You imagine James Rodriguez probably isn't long for this match either. 70th minute, goal. Colombia. There's confusion all over the field, and Colombia take advantage as Richard Rios has a fourth for his national team. It appeared that the official was about to stop play as there's a blatant foul by Giovanni Welch on Daniel Munoz at the top of the 18-yard box. A clear as day penalty. The official put the whistle to his mouth and all the defenders stopped playing, but the whistle never blew and Rios blasts the ball into the net. Panama can have no complaints. As the referee let play go for just a moment and the advantage worked to Colombia's advantage. 73rd Min, straight after the goal, there's more changes for Colombia as Daniel Munoz exits play after assisting Colombia's fourth goal. Replaced by Santiago Arias. Also entering is Juan Quintero who takes James Rodriguez's place on the wing. A few minutes later, Juan Cordoba is hauled off and replaced by Miguel Borja. 80th Minute, Chance, Panama. The CONCACAF nation isn't going down quietly and a shot by Michael Murillo from out top the penalty area forces a big save by Camilo Vargas. 85th Min, Colombian substitute Miguel Borja looks to be through on goal but he's tackled at the last possible moment and then whistled for offside. 
90 plus 2 minute, penalty, Colombia. A yellow card is shown to Jose Cordoba as he pulverizes Santiago Arias in the penalty area while the Colombian substitute is on the run chasing a long ball. It's a truly reckless and unnecessary challenge that unfortunately leaves the Panama defender in worse shape. Eventually, when the medical staff clears the situation, Miguel Borja steps up to take. And dot goal. Colombia. He sends Orlando Mascara the wrong way and buries the penalty. That's the last kick of the match as the referee sees no reason to continue with two added minutes long gone. Full-time, Colombia 5-0 Panama. Total domination from Colombia from start to finish as they clobber Panama and advance to the Copa America semifinals, moving the unbeaten streak to 27 games in the process. James Rodriguez is the star performer, but there are plenty of Colombians who can be proud of their performances. Ihan Cordoba and Richard Rios got goals, as did dribbling wizard Luis Diaz, who feasted on spaces in behind a desperate opponent playing from behind early. Colombia's unbeaten streak will now be tested against one of CONMEBOL's strongest sides, either Brazil or Uruguay. In the semifinals, thanks for your watching, don't forget to click the subscribed button and hit the bell icon for more.